Can one St. Paul Skyway close several hours earlier than the other Skyways? That is what the St. Paul City Council has been considering this afternoon. The Skyway that they're talking about is over 6th Street in Lower Town. Reg Chapman is in St. Paul right now to explain why some people want this Skyway closed and others don't. Hi, Reg. How you doing? I say the owners of the Railroad Exchange building say they have had enough of the homeless using the Skyway that runs through their building as a bathroom and a place to hang out. They are hoping the city of St. Paul will allow them to lock down the access to that Skyway at 8 p.m. But a group of residents don't want that to happen. These residents happen to be in wheelchairs, and they say locking the doors restricts their access and violates their rights. Rick Cardenas says he can't get to his favorite restaurant if the Skyway is closed. But attorney Chuck Repke says his clients are not responsible for providing access to a restaurant that was built after his clients purchased the building and Skyway easement. Rep Repke says his clients want the same consideration government buildings get. They are allowed to lock down the Skyway near them early earlier than the city's ordinances 2 a.m. requirement. It's a fairness argument. Five places are closed in St. Paul, all for the, who are in the exact same situation as us. The end of the Skyway ought to be able to close when no one wants to go past it. They've done it five times. They just do it only for government buildings. They've done it for Metro Square, the Children's Museum, Federal Courts Building, Sibley Building, City Hall Courthouse. Those places get to be closed. We don't. Now, this ordeal is far from over. St. Paul City Council today voted to continue a public hearing. The public hearing today only lasted five minutes for each side. They will have an expanded one on the 21st. Now, also during that time, residents of Mears Park who are concerned, as well as some of these building owners, will be meeting on June 26 and 28, and they all hope to come up with some type of of of. of, of a partnership, figuring out what's going on with the Skyway here in St. Paul. They, some people say they want the Skyway to close at 12 a.m., but they're going to poll residents and business owners to decide what's the best for everyone involved here in Mears Park. All right. Thank you, Reg.